all the ghetto, extravagant, resurrect the track and it's militant, and I react like a convict and start killing, it's manifesting, the gods work like appliances, dealing in my cycle, I'm like, Yo, what's going on guys? So I want to have a conversation with you guys about the follow-up of what's going on in the Boruto franchise now that urashiki has been defeated. And one question I've seen a lot in the last couple of weeks is what's going on with Teneri? Has Teneri been unsealed from the Dragon King Palace that uh, Urashiki essentially sent him away to? Is Teneri back on the moon? Is he going to make a, another return in the anime? And I know a lot of people are just saying this is a huge plot hole. And I'll say I disagree with you on that. And the reason why I disagree with you is I don't think that tenary has been unsealed. I know that, I know a lot of people want to see him come back because of the information he has about the Jogon. As much as I would like to see that happen, I don't think that that's going to be the case. So essentially, you guys have to remember that in the Naruto universe, just because you defeat the caster of a Jutsu doesn't mean the Jutsu is undone. Now, I know a lot of people say, oh, well, Itachi said every Jutsu has a weakness. Yes, every Jutsu has a weakness. And I'm sure there's one when it comes to where Urashiki sent Teneri into the Dragon King Palace. I'm sure there's something that is going to come back up at a certain point but it, you have to look at it from this perspective that could be a moment where they essentially did that so they can write Teneri out and not bring him back into the story that is something that is possible and i'll explain to you guys why so you have to remember that not all jutsu go away when the caster dies that's why edo tensei is so freaking dangerous because you can kill the caster you can snap his neck you can do whatever you want to him but until he breaks the jutsu edo tensei is going to be running around you can have all these powerful ninja or whatever you're fighting continuing to act outside of the caster and i don't think it's out the realm of possibility that someone in the suski clan has jutsu that isn't going to be dispelled after they pass away we know that one thing that they say is that their whole purpose of the clan is to transfer power to transfer on things i definitely think that having jutsu that can't be wiped out after they leave basically jutsu that can't be dispelled after they pass away i think that's something in line with those characters and when it comes to urashiki you gotta remember he knew he was going to earth he knew he was about to face some really overpowered beings in naruto and sasuke sure he had the whole squad backing him up he had ken shiki and momo shiki there with him he knew that there was a possibility possibility that okay if things get crazy i could end up dying why would he send teneri to a place the dragon king palace and have him seal away there if he knew there was a possibility he'd die and teneri would essentially get essentially brought back to the moon i definitely think that they set this up to where yes urashiki is dead but teneri is still sealed away that could be a future plot point but i think that until they get an idea of what they want to do with the jogon i don't think that teneri is going to be unsealed there and i definitely think that if that is something the best way we could see Teneri getting unsealed because Urashiki essentially sealed him away there they could write that into the story where it's a dimension or it's a place that is connected with Ususki chakra and because the Jogon has some ties into the Suski clan I think that'd be a good way to try and segue there have Teneri maybe project himself into Boruto's consciousness like he did from the moon all the way to earth have Teneri project himself into Boruto and Boruto's Jogon essentially be the way that Teneri gets out I want to know from you guys are you okay with this idea let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below but as always guys if you like anything i had to say don't forget to comment rate subscribe and share thank you so much for watching until the end have an awesome day guys